In this tutorial I will be explaining how to do short rows. I have incorporated short rows into the pattern for the dog's tail as they will enable the tail to curve slightly and you now join me on row 19 of the pattern for the dog's tail which firstly says knit 11 stitches which I've already done as you can see. Then we need to slip the next stitch on the left hand needle onto the right hand needle and then bring the yarn forward between the two needles like so. Then we need to slip the stitch on the right hand needle back onto the left hand needle and then we need to take the yarn back. We then need to turn the work at this point like so. And pull nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Then at this point we need to slip the next stitch on the left hand needle to the right hand needle. Then take the yarn back, slip this stitch back onto the left hand needle and then bring the yarn forward like so. And once again turn the work. And these wraps and turns prevent holes forming at the end of the short rows. So now we need to knit to the end of this row like so. And then to hide the bars that are made when the stitches are wrapped, I would recommend knitting the bar and the stitch together. So you simply pick up the bar and the stitch like so and then knit these two th th uh, stitches together like so and then that just gives a nice, nice neat finish. And then on the reverse We need to pull the next row and then once again to hide the bar that is formed you need to pull the bar and the stitch together. 